Yeah, have you subscribed to my channel? No. Well, you better do that now. Let's see, 15, 15 long subscribers, you see. Oh yeah, I did lie on there then. Yeah, see, look at that. Great, I'll tune in for the next one. Thanks. It is Monday, the start of another week. I can't wait to get absolutely buzzing and smashed through it. So this morning I spent a bit of time smashing out an RPM for the week. Um, what I've done recently is actually move my planning from daily planning, but obviously referring to project timelines, to actually weekly planning. So I've made my uh, list of outcomes for the week, scheduled in time to make sure I can um, work on all the appropriate areas. And on a day-to-day -day basis, it means that I don't need to prepare such a, a detailed outcome list, so I just refer back to my weekly. It gives me a bit more flexibility as well to move things around. So I spent um, about half an hour doing my plan for the week uh, this morning, um, and I think I'm going to do another video about that, specifically how I plan the week to make the most efficient use of my time and make sure I'm powering through uh, on the outcomes. Anyway, right now I'm downstairs in my residence lounge um, and I've got uh, some finance meetings with, some, um, with JLL to talk about um, the way in which we're going to approach the funding uh, for London Bridge Project. So I'm going to get stuck into that. See you soon. So that meeting was all done with JLL, went, went pretty well. Um, just skipped across town, had a quick PR meet, meet uh, marketing call uh, on the, in the car on the way over. I uh, just arrived at uh, Loftbury to have an uh, introduction chat uh, and talk a little bit about what we're doing in terms of the uh, asset management pipeline on the bridge project, uh, make the connection and see, um, and see how we think it, uh, it, might, it might fit together. So, Safi, what's happening? Well, over in the city, sitting actually quite high, it's quite nice to look over, uh, over town yeah. and uh, going to see if there's uh, any opportunities to have some discussion with these guys about some money. <laughs> uh, but more importantly, just introduce and uh, build a network. Good, good. All right, just kicking off a meeting with a couple of guys from uh, PwC. We're, we're doing some accounting stuff at the moment, so uh, looking forward to have a little chat with these guys and see, and see if it's going to be a, a good fit for us. Tuesday today has been a super busy day so far. Uh, this morning kicked off. I, did, I couldn't do any filming in there unfortunately. I was in my lawyer's office um, having a meeting uh, with a competitor um, who actually is interested in selling their business. So we had a good chat about kind of their vision, what they're looking to do, reasons that they're looking to exit um, alongside the um, vision that I have for Spaces to see if there's actually some way that we could work together or I could acquire their their, uh, their company or maybe there's um, you know some sort of JV structure that we could like, we could do. It was a really positive meeting. Um, uh, it's, uh, took, uh, took up the best part of the whole morning and we've gotten some real detail there. So that was definitely a good meeting. Right now, uh, it's Tuesday evening and I am on my way to meet one of my buddies for uh, dinner. Uh, go to one of my favorite restaurants in London, Street XO. I think it's absolutely delicious. Um, and I'll, I'll do a little bit of shooting when I'm in there. So uh, yeah, catch up with Rob, who's a, who's a good buddy of mine, who I've known for many years now. Uh, he's another real estate guy as well. So it should be an interesting evening of uh, conversation and no doubt we'll be discussing some deals as well so Rob in true style is late as always so I'm chilling out for a quick virgin cocktail whilst I wait for him to arrive so this is Rob hi guys tell me about yourself Rob I know I'm quite counter shy <laughs> Rob, when you meet him, he's like a serious real estate investor, oh, no, developer, no, no, he's a hustler, he's a dealer. No, 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 he's like a big, like, well built guy, he's a boxer, but then, you know, he gets shy and scared when the camera yeah. comes out. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hi. Thank you very much. Amazing, thanks. So, um, should we have a drink to life? To life. Good health. Good health and uh, he's a success and living life to the max. Living life to the full. Absolutely. What do you think, bro? Have a drink. Very good, very good. So, anyways, um, so, look, make sure Shaz, 
I'm not just saying this because uh, make sure you subscribe to his channels. Um, he's a, one of the most interesting guys I know, and I know a lot of different people in this world. He's very talented, passionate, wants to do good for the world. He's just passionate and loves life, and um, his energy is great. So you probably feel his energy when you uh, when you watch his shows. Anyway, love you guys lots. See you soon. Oh, that's really cute. Thanks, Rob. I didn't, I didn't even ask him to say no, that. No, you didn't. No. Yeah. Cheers, man. So we're, we're going to get down and uh, take a look at the menu and order order some food, have an awesome dinner, catching up. Yeah. So uh, peace out. We'll let you know how it goes. Take care. Bye. Yeah, yeah, so it is Wednesday morning. I've got to shoot over to the Jaguar showroom in Mayfair quickly, do a few little bits regarding my car, and then got to shoot back across town for a team photo shoot today. Should be a fun, fun day. How's it going, guys? Very good. Very good. Very good. How are you? So now we're floating around South Bank and Borough Market and all and all the rest of it, shooting a whole bunch of video content for some of the website stuff. Um, so we're shooting a couple of videos. One is an overall um, kind of about the company, uh, and one is for the recruitment video. So people can really start to get a feel for what the company is really about. We've got like various team members being interviewed and photo shot, and we should get some pretty exciting content out of it. <laughs> So it's my turn, the whole team have been interviewed on camera and have had their photo shoots. So it's time for Shazzy B to get grilled. Let's see how I perform. So that is the video shoot done. It was pretty painless. I don't like being put on the spot asking questions, despite how much I like to chat when I'm recording these little videos, because they're spontaneous. But I've got asked a few questions, a few surprise questions in there as well. Let's, uh, let's see what the final cut looks like. Yes, yes, yes. It is Thursday morning. I've got a shoot over to, um, uh, one of the London Bridge sites uh, this afternoon. We got a site visit with some investors. Prior to that, I got a couple of hours in the uh, in the office. I'm um, so gonna shoot across town now. So right now, we're shooting across to the London Bridge site to meet with the private equity guys who have just been touring our Elephant and Castle holdings. Uh, we're taking them around London Bridge site now, and then we'll have a, a meeting and a debrief um, in one of the units on, on the site. Super excited because we've been courting these guys for a, for a few weeks now, had a, a several meetings with them. Um, so hopefully today we might get down to um, a bit of nitty gritty, time permitting. Um, so yeah, looking forward to see how it unfolds. I think it's all covered there, right? We just gotta take it to the next level. One of the things I love the most about living in London is just the fact that on a day-to-day -day basis I get to experience some of our nation's most famous landmarks. I mean, on my day-to-day -day route to and from the office, I get to go over Tower Bridge. I get to go past the Houses of Parliament, depending on which route I'm taking. I get to drive past the city. I get to drive along the river. Um, it's just so such a privileged um, experience to have. Um, people from around the world fly to London to see these sites, uh, and here they are, you know, on my doorstep. And it's just really nice to take a moment to appreciate them from time to time. So we came to uh, the Luna Cinema thing tonight, where they have their outdoor screening. So we're in uh, Westminster Abbey, and we are seeing uh, Notting Hill, which I haven't seen for many years. So it should be fun. So I had to be really casual. I actually dressed up tonight, but now I'm just like so casual. Ah, nice. And the movie is starting. It's Friday. And you know what that means. It means it is the end of another week. Let's go smash it. We've got a chisel cardio, so it should be relatively lightweight and a lot of like kind of faster movements. I haven't done this workout before, so uh, let's see how it goes. Workout done. Sweating like a 
a pig, doing a few stretches to cool down. What I realised is um, I need to tighten up my diet a little bit because uh, I'm not stripping enough fat quickly on my, on my stomach region. Uh, so I'm going to tweak the diet over the next kind of week or so and see if I can shed a little bit of extra fat. Can't wait to get started on the work day. All right, just heading into the office right now. I've got to smash through uh, this pitch deck. Um, by the time I get there, just going to quickly read through it, annotate it so I can feed back to uh, the guys who are prepping it for me. I'm actually feeling really good today. Something that I think my girlfriend mentioned to me is that on Fridays I tend to be buzzing. Um, and I'm not really sure why that is. It might be because Thursday nights I tend to go out. Or maybe it's because it's the end of the week and I'm looking forward to rounding up another successful seven days of productivity. Either way, I'm buzzing. So end of another week, been absolutely smashing it out, had my head down, plowing through lots of work on many different areas of the business this week. If you like what you've been seeing so far, subscribe to the channel, share it if you like, uh, and actually you can feel free to send some comments on um, what areas you'd like me to cover in more detail. Looking forward to it.